Hello friends, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Candy. I'm a mom to five. On my channel, I share a lot of homeschooling, homesteading, gardening, day in the life, what's for dinner, canning, and grocery haul videos. Today, I have a grocery haul for you guys. I went to Sam's Club and Walmart and picked up all this stuff, so let's jump right into it. We spent a little over $900 on all of this, and it is piled sky high, and it's late, and I need to get dinner started. So I'm going to be putting things away as I go, but I'm going to show you guys everything we picked up. And if I have a plan set for that item, we will discuss it. One five-pound roll will be chili, and then this other five-pound roll, and the two ten-pound rolls will be divided up and go in the freezer. We will make burgers, and then the rest we'll just um, have on hand. We got some chicken drumsticks at Sam's Club. We also got a great big pack of pork chops. We divided that into three meals to do fried pork chops, smothered pork chops, and then we will put some on the charcoal grill. I grabbed some country style ribs. No plan just yet on those. We will probably throw them in the smoker. And then we also picked up some pork steaks. We love to charcoal those. Those are all from Sam's Club. And then over here, we got a package of New York strips from Sam's Club. And we got a pack of two chuck roast. I think I'm going to use one of those for our class's Sunday school um, Christmas party. I'm not sure 100% yet. We got a package of Little Smokies. We like to do those sometimes for breakfast with scrambled eggs. I got three packages of bacon. We only cook half a pound of that at a time when we do breakfast and then usually do sausage or something with it. We got some fish. I like to bread and fry those with half flour, half potato flakes. Over here, we've got ribs. We got a $24 slab or two slabs. I think it is two slabs. Yes, two slabs of spare ribs. And then over here, we got two slabs of baby back ribs for $20. Um, those will all go on the smoker most likely. Sometimes we slow cook them, but mostly we throw them on the smoker. Two pork loins. This one right here was $20.47. And then we have another one. Let me move the sausage so I can get to it. Um, I did um, pork chops with these. I did one roast off the end of each, but the rest was boneless pork chops. And then we have our roll of sausage. I divided that in three and froze it for biscuits and gravy. Or uh, sometimes we cook some sausage, drain the grease off, and then add it to scrambled eggs. We have a ham to cook on Christmas. It is a spiral cut ham. I'm trying to find the tag here. It was $16.31, which is about $10, $15 cheaper than what Walmart has them. We have some Eckrich smoked sausages. Those are a thing we do for breakfast quite often with fried eggs. This boneless carver ham was $13.55. James wanted that to slice up for lunch meat. And then we got some honey barbecue chicken bites. And we also got some of the buffalo ones. We are going to use those for a quick and easy dinner, maybe a lunch as well for a busy day. And then we got our eggs from Walmart for 11 bucks, strawberries, cuties. We have our mushrooms, which a package of those got left in the car, so I've got to go get it. Um, we have blueberries. We've got two packages of blackberries. The blueberries were like $4. The blackberries were only three bucks. I should have bought more, but I just grabbed two. Um, and then we got a big package of tomatoes because we're going to be doing burgers and salad and things. Broccoli florets because we've been out of broccoli in the freezer and the kids are broccoli eaters. Some of this fudge drizzled popcorn for a fun dessert when we watch Christmas movies, some gravy, and then over here we've got a whole bunch of stuff. Let's see, we've got the donut shop coffee. We got that at Sam's Club. James prefers the donut shop coffees, so we just picked that up. I think it was like nine dollars for that. I, something like that. Egg rolls for when we do tempura chicken one night because we like to do Chinese food at home pretty often. We got some sausage rolls. Where I come from, kolache is a donut, but they call them kolaches. Sausage rolls, um, we do those with scrambled eggs. Some eggnog, again, for Christmas movie time, just for fun. Some frozen biscuits, we do those for sausage biscuits, biscuits and gravy, things like that. Fudge for my Sunday school Christmas party. I usually make it from scratch, but I thought we would give this a try, so... I'm going to make that for that party. And then some fun breakfast. We got some hot chocolate and some cinnamon roll pancake and waffle mixes. So we'll be doing those some mornings coming up. Tomato sauce for chili. Some mint fudge baking chips. James and I make chocolate mint cookies every year together at Christmas time. 
cocoa mix. We got a big tub of margarine, pineapple. The kids and James just like to have a bowl of pineapple sometimes after dinner. And Sam's Club has the best deal on those. Butter, ramen for some quick and easy lunches, Velveeta, maybe probably a nacho night. We didn't really plan on it, but we do have tortilla chips here. And then this glitter and edible shimmer and sprinkles. Um, those are for both our um, homeschool co-ops Christmas party when they do cookie decorating and for our Christmas cookies that we do here at home because we always do a whole bunch of sugar cookies before Christmas. Um, cornstarch was something that we just needed. I ran out last time I made gravy, so I picked one up. Probably should have grabbed two, but I just grabbed one. Chocolate peppermint donut kit. I thought that was really cute and the kids would enjoy that for a fun Christmas, you know, themed breakfast. A peppermint fudge kit. Again, just something fun. Bagels for some quick and easy breakfast on speech therapy days because we can just toast them and add cream cheese. Some crumbled bacon just to have on hand. Mayo. Some cooking spray. Some A1. Heinz 57. We were low on a lot of things. Um, ketchup. Miracle Whip, ranch dressing, and then we got some syrup. And then these were an impulse buy. I think they'll be really good. It's pineapple spears and coconut water. Thought we'd have those um, maybe like as a side to a lunch one day and give those a try. So if you guys have tried them, let me know in the comments. I got some caramelized onion butter. That sounded really good. And then some gourmet burger seasoning for tonight's burgers for dinner. I'm out of the burger seasoning I normally use. And then we got some country time lemonade. Here is the sushi I picked up for the kids to snack on while they wait on me to get all the groceries put away and dinner made. As you can see, they've already been into it, um, but they're going to take that in there and eat it while they watch a Christmas movie. We got some mushrooms. We got a big pack of olives. Mushrooms and olives go fast in our house. I really should have bought two of each, but um, it'll be fine. I got some cream of mushroom soup, some Reese's bars, just a mom snack because moms need treats sometimes, some ranch beans. James eats ranch beans with um, probably at least two meals a week, and then we got some Ritz crackers. I got a big bag of pancake mix. I love Sam's Club's pancake mix. It just makes life so much easier when it comes time to make breakfast. I grabbed two jars of mincemeat. James's dad loves mincemeat pie. We couldn't find him a mincemeat pie, so I'm just going to make him one. A box of pasta. It's got elbows, penne, and spaghetti in it. That's just kind of a stock up item. We always have quite a bit of pasta in our house, but I just wanted to make sure we had plenty. We got some oatmeal, and then I've got some corn, refried beans, and peas. We have a lot of green beans on hand, so I didn't buy any of those. I've got some um, hamburger buns right here, and then I've got some cereal. I'll show you guys what cereals I got. Let's see, we've got, hold on, I've got a mess going on, so just give me a second, guys, but um, I grabbed two boxes of cereal. I think they're like two boxes. They're equivalent to two boxes each. So I've got the cinnamon toast crunch and I've got the fruity pebbles. And then I also got a cappuccino mix that's under the Velveeta that I forgot to show you guys. That's everything we picked up at Sam's Club and Walmart. I hope you guys enjoyed this grocery haul, even though it was kind of a messy grocery haul. Um, thank you guys so much for watching. Leave a comment below so we can chat and I'll see you guys next time with another new video. Bye guys.